Um... Also, there's something I noticed while I was analyzing the program. So... Looks like some parts of the program was rewritten. Huh? Program's been rewritten? Oh. Oh. Obviously, Mew is the only per person capable of doing that. Hey, hey! Oh, which files did you rewrite? And what did you change? Okay! I'll analyze that, of course, but it's gonna take a little time. Yeah. Well, as long as it's done by the time the class trial, then Shuchi will be able to avenge Mew. <sighs> He's just saying whatever he pleases. Alright! Alright! And I'll keep on analyzing the crap out of this program. <laughs> <laughs> You're so reliable. That's true. Yeah, way more than you. Mm. I never thought Mew would be killed. When I saw our avatar there, not moving, I thought maybe, but... You're right. That's right. You saw Mew's avatar in the virtual world that stopped moving. Mm. Me, Kibo, and Maki all found our avatar. Hey! Can you tell me about that? Any details? I... We were looking for the secret of the outside world at the uh, at the chapel. Hey! And Mew was there too, right? No. No, Mew volunteered to look around outside the chapel, so she wasn't with us. Mew volunteered to look outside. <sighs> we searched, but we couldn't find anything. That's right when we started getting tired. Mm. All of a sudden, we heard a really loud sound outside. That must have been. Mm. That must have been a sound we heard. I heard as well. Mm. Something must have hit the wall of the chapel really hard. We felt it from all the way inside. Something hit the wall of the chapel. Mm. So we rushed over, uh, rushed outside to check uh, the side of the avatar, and we found that to the side of the chapel, and we found Mew's avatar. Uh, um... And that's when you went to log out to check the, uh, Mew's real body, right? Correct? But... but when we went to the river, the bridge was gone for some reason. Oh, and while we were standing around wondering what to do, you guys showed up. Thank you. I see. Thank you. Oh. That testimony sounded important. Especially how they couldn't cross the river. Because? Because if they weren't able to cross the river, then no one could have gone between the mansion and the chapel. <laughs> And that helps us narrow down who could have come in contact with Miu. Who could have come into contact with Miu at the chapel? Hmm. Hey! Guntar, you're alright. You're so dumb. Are you still depressed about Miu? Come on, don't be such a dubby downer. By the way. Oh, Gunta. I want to know what you think. Rare, I know. But who do you think the culprit is? Gunta don't know. Gunta not know. Murder already happened when Gunta awake. How this but happened? Why this happened? Why Miyu killed? Gunta not understand. Gunta not understand anything. How can this be? But Gunta frustrated and sad. Gunta no could protect Miyu. He seems all over the place right now. Oh man. He can't think at all when he's like this. It's true! But uh, Gunta doesn't seem to be lying. So I'm pretty sure he's telling the truth. Well, I guess the big dum dum like Gunta doesn't have the brains to lie in the first place. Hey! Don't talk to him. Don't talk to him like that. Don't talk about him like that. I'm so disappointed in you, Gunta. When I first met you, I thought you'd be more useful. Sorry! Sorry. Gunta, Gunta, sorry. Gunta, sorry. He could no protect me, you. Gunta. Hey! If you feel that bad about it, then stop blaming yourself. Help us find the culprit instead. This is the culprit's fault anyway, so pull yourself together and help us, okay? Mm. Okay. Gunta, understand. Gunta, do his best. Gunta, do his best to find culprit. Gunta, definitely do his best this time. Yeah. Yep, yeah, now that's a spirit. Now Kukichi's encouraging him? I really don't know what Kukichi's thinking. It's just one piece of hair that's like... Oop, there we go, fixed. <laughs> I suppose I've investigated everything I can here. Hey! Are you done investigating the crime scene? So, 
Do you know who the culprit is yet? No. No. Might not actually be the crime scene. Injuries in the virtual world could be fatal in the real world. Meaning there is a possibility that she was killed in the virtual world. Which means the next area I should investigate. Oh, I see. Ah, the virtual world. You should go there again. Huh? Huh? See? I just read your mind, didn't I? I did, right? 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 Got it. That's the case, and I'm coming too. Oh? Oh, great. He's coming. You must really like me, huh? Ugh. Say whatever you want. I don't have time to waste on you. Yeah. If we go back to the virtual world, we might find some new clues. With those, I might be able to clear my name. Um. May I join you as well? I also think we should investigate the virtual world again. All right. Why don't we all go? Ah. Oh. Do I get to be that avatar again? What? Huh? Did, did you actually like the avatar after all? Well. I'm going to stay here. He's still in the middle of analyzing the program. Mm. Going to search this place some more. There's no time to be sleeping. That's not what we're... Uh, that's fine. <laughs> uh, then I'll stay here too. Huh? What? Mm -hmm. Surprised? Are you gonna get lonely without your partner? My bad. I'm busy too, you know. I gotta watch out. Uh, I got... I'm busy too, you know. I have to watch Maki. In case she tries to do anything deceitful. Huh? Deceitful? See? Well, you and Kaito were pretty close. So you might do something deceitful for him, right? Thank goodness. Good thing Gunta's with me. Your glare is scary to handle alone. Gunta would risk his life to protect me from a murderer. Huh? Huh? Hey! Hey, you keep saying messed up crap like that. I'm gonna kick your ass into orbit. All right already. It's fine. Just ignore him and hurry to the virtual world. Uh, okay. Kaito, let's just focus on solving the case for now. <laughs> Fine. Thank goodness. Thank God. I don't like violence. The ultimate supreme leader would rather sneak around. So that means... So anyway, I'll leave the virtual world to you, Yuichi. Yeah. But I'm not exaggerating when I say this class trial can only be solved by you, okay? Your talent can save the useless people here, you know? What? Who are you calling useless? I told you. Enough already. Um. Kaito, let's go. Kaito, Kibo, Himiko, Sumugi, and I prepared to enter the virtual world. We picked up our helmets once again, sitting in the same seats as before. So the red cord goes in the right side and the blue cord in the left, yeah? Yeah, let's do that. Right is the hand I hold my chopsticks with. I gotta be sure to get it right. If you're that worried, why don't you use one that's already set up? We place the devices on our head and flip the switch. Welcome to the Neo World program. Can't believe it's back. <laughs>